Well, it's so nice you joined me today for Climb the Heights, my daily devotional based upon my book, First Things First. I went out to mow the lawn the other day. You know, uh, we've had some pretty hot days, and uh, I wanted to get an early start. And uh, I think you're supposed to wait until about 8 o'clock in our town to get out and uh, start running lawnmowers. Although roofers don't pay much attention to that noise factor. <laughs> but anyway, I was getting out there and getting an, an early start. And I, I only got about, uh, I don't know, maybe a fourth of the lawn mowed and I had to stop. The grass was wet with dew. It had, uh, it had uh, gotten wet during the night just from dew, not from being sprinkled, but, but from dew. And it was, just, it was just plugging up the lawnmower. So I had to wait till later in the day when it was a lot hotter <laughs> and the, the grass had dried out to be able to mow the lawn. Well, it's that time of year when uh, harvest is uh, upon us and it's exciting to see the harvest come in. And here's a blessing from Genesis chapter 27, verse 28. May God give you the dew of heaven and the fatness of the earth and plenty of grain and wine. Here's our prayer for this day. Father, the harvest is upon us in full swing. We thank you for your blessings and pray for a bountiful yield. Bless our farmers and ranchers in the work of their hands. May their crops and cattle multiply and bring prosperity to their families and community. Protect them in the fields and on the roads, and may they find help and strength as they bring in the harvest. In Christ's blessed name, amen. Well, that's a good thing to do, isn't it? Let's keep our farmers and ranchers in prayer during this time of harvest. And I look forward to visiting again tomorrow.